Hey, it's Coolio if you don't know, and it is time for some more of the extra long run where we are playing Kirby in the Forgotten Land. We're only up to 83%. Uh, at the current rate that we've been going, you would think that we would get 100% today. Um, that's probably not going to happen because we basically have to play like every level again except for three of them. <laughs> Because, um, hey, J-Pop, how you doing? So, yeah, we have a lot of cleanup to do. Um, the DLEDs here. Let's first go check out um, the ability shop here, the weapons shop, and see what we still have to unlock. We're not going to be able to to buy anything but well i have three rare stones what do i got here the only thing that we have left to unlock is the uh mask ddd's hammer so Shouldn't take that long either. Uh, we'll we'll see. Um, since you you probably uh, I think I have all the blueprints actually. Morpho sword. Whoa ho 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 ho! Right. I forgot about that. All right, um, but yeah, like, since, since you probably know, Tyrion, if I get a hidden Waddle D and then exit the level, will I still have that Waddle D? Because if we have to get to the end of each level, you need to beat the level. Yeah, if we have to get to the to the end of each level, we're probably not finishing today, but we'll see. Uh so first one wins. Uh out of all of the abilities. Oh, except for sleep. I'm gonna use sleep like right now. Just to just to see what free buff we can get out of it. But out of all of the abilities. Which one, um, which one do you want me to start with? Looks like we got an attack buff to start with. Probably will take more than just one stream, yeah. Not sure if choice paralysis or uh, just indifference. Out of all of the abilities, which one do you want me to start with? I I put that as a poll, but I don't think. You want me to use gun? Alright, I'll use gun, I guess. I put it as, as like a Twitch poll, but for one thing, I'm pretty sure there's only two people in chat right now, and for two, I don't think Twitch polls allow 11 options. Oh, right. Um... Thanks to local celebrity Fat Apollo, uh, I have a present code. Yeah. 
And here it is, Kirby. Snacks. There we go. Yeah, those are some snacks, all right. Oh, and we get to we get to bring the burger with us. Nice. All right. Okie dokie. So let's get started with the cleanup effort. Uh, stage list is Y. Oh, I think I can just loop around, right? Yeah. So make five tulips bloom. I think that's just the action of like poking them and they uh they open up. There's one. I can see how I missed this one because I was just starting the game and I didn't really understand uh, the way that certain interactions worked. What's over here? Aha! Let's see. Oh, whatever. And one thing that that I can do is like, if we if we get one that uh, is like easily unlocked at the very beginning of a stage or something like that, then I can exit that stage and see if it stays unlocked. Okay, spit that out. That didn't count. If I do happen to find some uh, some capsules, I totally will go for those because uh, we're probably nowhere close to getting them all. Now. Once you know what to do, it's pretty much a matter of knowing the kind of nonsense Kirby games. I should I should hope that I know about the Kirby nonsense at this point, having played liter literally every game. But uh, sometimes you don't. You just miss the obvious. Th I know that sometimes I miss the obvious thing. That's for darn sure. I don't like a tulip down there now. And I guess that I can't actually break this one because it's not like busted. And I will also point out that there are still some objectives that are hidden. Because I, I didn't reveal every single objective in my original playthrough. Um, at this point, I will allow people to tell me 
if they know what those hidden objectives are as we get to them anyway. Let's don't don't go ahead and tell me like well in in like ten stages you'll need to uh find the secret entrance to like the underworld or whatever. I'm not gonna remember that. You don't remember most of them. Well, if you do happen to remember some of them, then the help would be appreciated. We have already missed two of uh, two of the things. Hmm. Let's go cutter, I guess. Well, that's disappointing. And the problem is, some of these might be like back in the first part of the stage where I can't get them anymore. There's one there. How many how many am I supposed to have? Well at this point I should have all five, right? Because it's the end of the stage. Not the end of the stage. Did I just misinterpret that, Kate? That was a regular that was a regular D, wasn't it? That was there to uh introduce us to the fact that hey Yeah, that was a silver key. Alright. Alright. All right. Uh, that's me embarrassing myself. Did I just swallow my own cutter? Now. Stop jumping over my attacks, you jerk. Oh, 
also that uh that vine mechanic um doesn't really come up a whole lot in this game, does it? It's like they they put it into this first area and then they kind of forgot it existed. Yeah, there's number four. The the thing where I had to use the cutter to, to cut down this uh this cone. You don't really see a whole lot of that in this game. Oh, there's the last one. There we go. Ow. Go ahead and heal up. And you're going to hit that. I'm going to hit it too. Get a capsule. There's the golden gauge. All right. Money. They only thought of one puzzle to do with it? Yeah, I guess. And, uh, yeah, these are duplicates, I guess. I don't know if they're, like, set. If they're set, then I might not bother to look for them as much. They're not. All right. Okay, remove the wanted poster is what we need to do. If y'all see the wanted poster and I don't, let me know. Let's go casually run into this copy, like nobody's business. Uh, is there, was there a fire dude out here? Yeah, there was. Thank you. So I casually run into everything, apparently. That thanks for uh thanks for the hint there j pop being pro strats there Let's see if I can, uh, yikes, it's not what I want to do. Um. 
um, That was a bit of a foolish move, but hey, it worked out. Make sure that the wanted poster isn't like in like a silly position where people wouldn't even be able to read it, much less uh Yeah. Anyway. People wouldn't be able to see it, much less read it, is what I was trying to say. It's going to be on one of these, isn't it? Wait, I uh, know. Yeah, if the uh, if the capsules aren't set, it's interesting then that we manage to like go the entire game without getting a duplicate until now. I'm also going to like presume at the very least that um the uh the tasks are probably more or less arranged in the order that they show up in. So the um the wanted poster would be like one of the last things you would do in the stage. Yeah, we we did not get a single duplicate until uh the that previous level. Except for the machine anyway. Like the the gotcha machine. But like within stages, is what I'm trying to say. What is this mound here? I feel if you came here with like Tor either tornado or drill, there might be something there. Because you wouldn't get tornado or drill, like, in the game up to that point. Hey, Jewel. How you doing? Jewel, fresh new recipient of um, VIP tags for her channel. And if you like uh, late game uh, World of Warcraft stuff, she does a lot of that on her, on her channel too. I don't get drilled until underwater world. I don't think we've seen the um the wanted poster yet. If that's picking up, by the way, keep in mind that I have a uh, laundry room, like, right next to me. Unfortunately, not much I can do about, about any noise there. It's 
a lot. There it is. All right, now we just need to make it to the end. Not gonna bother with that cannon. I was gonna rush it all away. Just love Kurt Kirby's mm, face. Frick. What's up, Jewel? Oh, I didn't send this bit. Yeah. Um, Twitch tends to trim any uh, any spaces that it finds extraneous, unfortunately. Now, so we missed a hidden D here. All right. We also need to eat four donuts and uh, navigate them all without getting lost, which we could have done last time. Um, I just decided to go exploring instead. I'm also generally going to try to not repeat stages. Like if I, if I miss a, uh, if I miss a Waddle D in a stage, I'll come back to that stage later. Like we'll we'll go back around like a third time. And the third time is probably gonna be a like super clean up. I do have to get everything in order to move on. Yeah, you, you, well, you might be right, uh, Tyrion. I, I don't know. We'll, we'll see how it goes. But at the same time, like, we have a lot of stages to go through. So. Ow. Jerk. Yeah, there's one donut. And a hyper candy. All right. Lots of those in uh in the Alival Mall. Both of the Alival Mall stages. Is it Alival or Alival? Uh. 
and then I fell. Try not running directly into the uh, the Gordo there. Okay. So this is what they mean by navigate without getting lost. We need to go to the hamburger shop first. I am going to get to the end of this uh this hallway here though just in case like there was a donut to, to find or something. We do need to find three more. You're in the hot seat now, buddy. Hmm. All right, you're giving me needle or fire. You no, know I'm keeping fire. Not really a fan of needle. Ow. Sometimes you don't need to run away. You need to run transverse. There we go. Many foods, but none of them None of them donuts. Bye. Also, why do they have these, uh, these moving platforms that just go off into oblivion. I want to call uh, I want to call Alival Mall's question, uh, practices into question here. It's like Alival, go oh, Dettel. It hadn't occurred to me the first time. Secret spot in the corner here. Ah, there's a donut. Thank you. I don't worry too much about coins. I think I have enough money for a while now. Hmm. 
He might be missing a donut, though. I get the feeling. Yeah, so we need to go to the ice cream shop. Cake, ice cream. All right. Did we go to the cake place last time? Okay, I I think I've locked myself out of uh, the getting lost one at this point. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, well, maybe not. That might have been where the last uh, hidden D was, though. This one's bolted to the wall. So we'll just remove the entire wall. So I think we got out of that without getting a single new, uh, a single new wall D here, unfortunately. Kirby, please. Yeah, three donuts. Um, I don't know if the game will say we got lost or not. Yep, we got lost. So we didn't get a single one. I am, um, unhappy with that result and we're going to do this stage again. So I guess I'm going back on the thing that I said and going on to the thing that Tyrion said. I don't know if I can remember where all of the uh, donuts were though. There we go. Hey, you're not withholding a donut from me, are you? No.
I mean, I I I would do that J-pop if one I knew what the controls were for that, and two I I if I knew what those were. Okay, there was there was a donut up here, right? There was a donut up here. Man, I know a triple axle is like, I'm pretty sure Kirby's doing that. I don't know what, what a Lutz is. I know it's a city in Florida. And I don't think there's anything interesting up here. So a cow? Do barrel! <laughs> oh geez. That is not where I want to go. Making sure I haven't missed a uh, a donut somewhere. Ice against ice, let's go. This is very ineffective. Oh, that was extremely effective, actually. This out frosty, Mr. Frosty. Just all casual light. No worries. I think there was a donut here, right? Especially this button. No. That button does that. This secret spot releases the donut. Watch there be like a donut in one of the um in one of the dead ends just to be a jerk. Okay. Now we know for sure we've been to the cake thing. 
We're going to go to the ice cream thing, which is the actual path forward. Ow. Ow there. Knocked RPG rules, check every dead end before. Well, the problem is, I can't do that. If I don't go to this path specifically, then I it counts as me having gotten lost in the mall. Was that not the right one? It did the noise. Like the bad noise. And then my way back is blocked off, so I can't just do it again. Yeah, and then here here I am at the end of the stage again. Having gotten two donuts, the third up here. Having not found the additional uh hidden wall D and having technically gotten lost in the in the mall. If I get lost then I don't I don't get a waddle D. See? I didn't get crap. Okay, I'm moving on. I don't want to be on a live home all, all night. I didn't think I got lost. I, I followed the sign both times. And both times was that was the incorrect path. So eat snacks off three tree stumps. Is map quest even still a thing? Now. You came back, so I'm going to grab you. Come on now. There we go. It's two. Oh, the cursor was going a little fast there. Can you please not, sir? It is still a thing. Interesting.
I'm assuming I'm assuming it's still a thing and it still does what it used to. Not like it's still a thing, but now they're like um they're like an adventurer's guild or some crap, I don't know. Looks like any maps app today. Gotcha. Hmm. There's a stump, but there's no snack on it. There's a secret spot right there. There's a snack. There we go. So now I can just rush to the end of the stage, because that was the last one. Oh. Gotta get the snacks, though. Oh, hey, it's Sim Guy. How you doing? Ow. Alright, I forgot I can just hold down the button for some reason. And poom. Oh dear. Mom block. Off we go. Has another stage complete. Now it's time for boss. Um, actually, yeah, yeah I did that one. Uh, defeat Gormando with the sword ability. Unfortunately, this I'm pretty sure is going to take multiple goes because. Like, I need to know what the, uh, the goals are without knowing that I can't, like, unless, unless one of y'all knows, I can't just guess. And even if one of y'all knows, some of these might be, like, defeat boss with specific ability, and if there's more than one of those, then I can't do them at the same time. So no pull for ability for these, because uh, I do need to actually... Hey, buddy. Strong arm beast, Gormondo.
there. Ow. There we go. Oh, and clear within two minutes, too. Oh, clear without taking any damage. Oh, that's... Oh, that's going to be interesting. I'm going to guess that probably every boss has one of those. Might also have like a time trial thing to it as well. Hmm. I go with bomb for this. All right, here we go. It doesn't really matter how long this takes, as long as we don't get hit. He appeared to have just gotten stuck there, which works out in my favor. Uh, lol link and all the numbers. Uh, hello and thank you for following. Why was the boss fight completely different than last time? Because the last time I was doing it uh, in melee range, uh, this time I was doing it at a distance. Also, if yeah, if you're referring to the last stream, I was doing the Forgo version there. Okay, so. 
Except for Live Them All, I've done all of those. And also done all of the. Hang on. There we go. Oops. Now also done all of the uh, treasures. So let's move on to Everbay Coast. Bend and Beach, I need to complete the sign on the rooftop. Yeah, because I, I was fighting at a distance is the thing. Stretch and posture, all right. Mm. Huh. Uh, what was the goal? <laughs> Complete the sign on the rooftop. Got it. So it's probably going to be near the end, considering that it is the third one. Capsule over there. My oh, yoga pics on your Twitter, that ain't happening, buddy. I'm just going to, you know, casually incinerate you. There we go. Come on. <laughs> Giving us hammer again here, so I'm gonna hold on to my hammer. It is interesting that they don't really make you go uh, underwater in this game. Like, is there any point in the game where you actually go underwater? Because if not, I think this might be like the first mainline Kirby game where you don't go underwater. Yeah, possibly. That's got to be timed. No problem. Yeah, as much as I'm pretty sure that the um, 
the sign on the building is not going to show up until like late in the stage because it is the third objective. I still want to like, for good measure, try to get as much of the level done as I can, or as much of the stage done as I can. I There it is. This is, yeah, this is what they're looking for. Right here. Ta-da! It, it feels a bit silly that I missed that the first time, but at the same time, like, if you're still getting used to the game and, like, the types of things that it asks you to do, and also the fact that you don't get to find out what it wants you to do until you've actually, like, cleared the stage. And this kind of request isn't that common, yeah. All right, that's one more stage done. The radio. A woofy. All of all these saved. Onto the concrete aisles of one hidden D, greet three seabirds, and make landfall on the Isle of Treasure. Let's do it. Of course, by greet three seabirds, they mean harass three seabirds. Now. There's one. It's weird, there is a greet button. There is a greet button. Except I can't actually push it while I'm in the water. Yeah, that's that's a good idea. Let's run into the crash bomb. So it's the third Waddle Dee that we're missing. That's probably the first one. I guess I have to clear this guy out here. There we go. Oh, I fell off. Capsule.
Ah, there's one. Dang it. Basically what happened there is I pressed the button like just before landing. So I did the aerial move instead. There we go. That's probably the second one. Ah, there's a third bird. So that one's clear. No matter what, we get at least one. Let's see. So now we need to make landfall on the Isle of Treasure. And if I had to guess, there's probably also a hidden Waddle D there too. Oh. Did we find this last time? Now we found three cages, and we didn't find the one that I was missing from last time. Was the Isle of Treasure on the previous screen? I guess it was. Ow. Really no warning that uh, those things are going to shoot. Well, we got one. Let's give this another go, but just one more time. And if you all see something that looks like an Isle of Treasure, please let me know. Yeah. 
You can tell me where it is. Please do, Tyrion. Look at the background at the at the end of either this area or the last one. Fail to notice the uh, the whirlpool down there. Oh. That that's it over there. But can I just like how do I get over there? Oh, gotcha. And that chest probably has the last wall of the Sure does. Yeah, it's nice enough to take us back here on a warp star so we can take this warp star and move on. I'll just eat you then. I've got your power. I can't eat the cannon. I sure can eat you. So I'll just spit you out instead. Oh, this is still plenty doable. In case you want to warp to your warp. There we go. Captured Waddle Dees. Already seen it. So oh, that's that. Um, I go back to town and uh, heal up. Who?
Okay, scale the cement summit. Wait, what? Must be a rare stone waiting at the end of each treasure road. Well, yes. So one hidden D and uh, freeze Florina with an ice ability. Well, there was a hidden D there. Uh, so I'm looking for the fourth hidden D specifically. So it's probably going to be near the end of the stage. Not sure how I avoided getting shot there, but you know, it happened. And now I have to freeze you. Come on, freeze. There we go. Got her. That's probably the second one. Which doesn't require the uh, the tornado ability, but it definitely makes it easier. There we go. That's the third one. So now we have to be on the lookout. There is a feature in Kirby Mass Attack where um, when you got a medal, whether or not you had gotten it before, it would tell you like which medal it is. Okay, so the last one's probably uh is probably somewhere in this thing. Let's probably just hit all of the rings.
Ow. I missed one. Wonder if I'll be able to get it. Yeah, there we go. Hopefully that counts. There it is. It says press A to spit, but you can pretty much press any button and and, uh, and you'll get rid of that. Because it's literally the only action that you can take. Bandana D. We're ready for adventure. Lantern switch. And that's another stage clear. Now time to head to our next stage. Fast flowing waterworks. And that's another stage clear. So now for this, we need to destroy Tropic Woods' roots. And also two hidden objectives, one of which is probably um, without getting it. But yeah, that was literally the only stage we had super clear during the first run. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, so I just needed to destroy one root, and somehow I managed to not do that the first time. That's without getting hit. <laughs> the most famous Waldian franchise, a D with headgear. Oh, we got that one. Yep, clear without taking any damage. And the one we're missing is. Clear without using a copy ability. All right. So we need to defeat this boss as normal Kirby. Oh, yeah, I have max fire, so. I have max most of the abilities at this point.
You know, Curry, wait, that's player two. Yeah, v vanilla as vanilla gets. Oops. Let's see if I can also do this with uh without taking any damage. Well, as soon as I say that. What? Dang it. Okay, I disagree with the hitbox for that, uh, for that fence. Ah! Oh, nice, that counted as a quadruple. There we go. Okay. So that is another boss stage clear with exactly 6,900 coins. Nice. You saved all the Waddle Dees in Everbay Coast. Oh, uh, before I do that. Uh, yep, got all the uh, treasure rifts in Everbay Coast as well. So let's go on to Wondaria. Enjoy the view from the top of the rocket. And there weren't any, uh, yeah, none of them in cages. I think this means... Um, the, the rocket thing at... Uh, there we go. That's the other one. So I want to save the ducklings, even if I don't have to. Are there five of them? Oh well. Unfortunately, the other one went went missing, and nobody ever heard from them again. The end. But yeah, there there is a uh, rocket that you can mouthful. Like a, a rocket um, roller coaster that you can now full near the end of the stage. I'm guessing it's just referring to like sitting on top of it for a second.
apparently. Oh, uh, I was not paying attention to where I was going there. Still not paying attention to where I'm going. The rocket's at the start? Like the start of the stage? Just want to make sure I'm clear before I hit exit here. All right. Oh, that rocket. I just have to climb this thing. Ta da! Actually, this is a good test. If I exit, uh, yeah, so it said completed missions will not be saved. I didn't finish reading before I hit the exit button, and then it was too late. At least now we know for sure. We still have to finish the stage. And this was this was like the perfect time to test because we just need to do that at the very beginning of the stage and there it is and there we go. And yeah, that is literally all we're missing. So now we can just make our way directly to the end. If I see any capsules, I'll still pick them up, but I'm not going to... I'm not going to make any more asides to get anything. Yeah. A water mouthful here. It, I did say that I wasn't going to take any asides, but I didn't really go aside to get that. I was just like right there.
And I think the other one's like, actually, is it like here? Oh yeah, there it is. Guess that was a bit of an aside, but whatever. I mean, y'all know me. I I'm the guy who is playing banjo, uh, not banjo, because a ukulele, and being like, "Okay, I'm going. I'm going to exit the stage now, and go do something else." And then I proceed to just stick around in the stage for the next half hour. And there we go. That's one more Waddle D saved. The stages are going pretty quickly, honestly. Um, as we're we're here, we're already here at World Three, and clearing things out at pretty steady pace. We're probably still not going to be done tonight, but next week, more than likely. Um, am I going to be able to, to do the, um, like the ultimate Coliseum or whatever it is? I can't guarantee that I will, but I'll definitely try. But for now, anyway, let us go ahead and take a break. Um, so in about 10 to 15 minutes, we're going to, uh, keep doing this. Keep clearing things out and um, hopefully uh, get as much done as we possibly can. So take a moment and uh, get something to drink, go to the bathroom, stretch your arms, stretch your legs, stretch your teeth. I don't know if Sim Guy is still here and just heard what I said. But um, yeah, we'll be back in a short little while here.